Hi, this is Chris, and we're now taking a look at compression of log functions. So in another video, we did expansions, and if you haven't seen that, check that out. But here, when you have to compress log functions, so as we talked about before, your, upon expansion, your multiplication will convert into addition between your log functions, and your division will convert into subtraction. So when we compress, we just go the reverse direction. So addition is going to indicate that when you bring them inside the same log function, they will be multiplied. So here to compress just these first two, we'll start small. So this will become log of five times x when we compress it into a single log function. And we can write everything else as is. And when we go to compress these, which are being subtracted, Upon compression, that will convert into division. And so here we will have log 5x divided by 3 and also divided by y. So we can write that as one log function. This is the log of 5x over 3y when we fully compress this expanded form of a log function. And that's really it for compression. We'll get into some more challenging examples later on, but for right now, in this intro to log compression, just remember that upon compression, addition gets converted into multiplication, like we see here, and subtraction, like we see here, gets converted into division, and you'll be good to go. Thanks for watching.